I really hope that you guys enjoyed just this really quick room tour of the Junior Suite on the Royal Caribbean's Navigator of the Seas Cruise. As soon as you walk in, when you turn to the right, you have the bathroom. I've never been on a cruise, so I didn't know how big the bathrooms were supposed to be, but I guess this is a very big bathroom for a cruise. You have to watch your step right there. You have the sink is right here, the toilet, there's towels, and then there's the bathtub with the shower. And they also provide little body lotions and shampoos, conditioners, and shower gels. Those are all just in the corner along with some little cups for uh, rinsing your mouth out. Immediately across from the bathroom is our walk-in closet. Which this is really nice. We haven't unpacked any of our stuff yet, so but there is plenty of room over here for shoes and there's plenty of space to hang up your clothes and these rooms also come with two robes, which is awesome. And then as you continue into the room, you have some storage right here. So you have like a bunch of shelves right here, which is great, especially if you're coming with a family and you need like a lot of room for clothes. The room did not come with champagne, but my amazing boyfriend got a champagne and chocolate. Yeah, and so there's like a big mirror right here to get ready. These also open right here if you need additional storage to store some stuff. And as soon as we walked in the room, we did have some papers right here that kind of showed like everything that was going on today on the cruise and different things like if you wanted to book some extra excursions. Um, we do have our tickets right here that came as soon as we got in the room and those are for our snorkeling. Um, on the other side of the wall, you do have some plugs right here. There are not a lot of plugs in this room. So I know that some people kind of thought that was like a critique. There's also more storage area up here right above the right above the TV. And then there's also a safe right here for like passports or important documents that you don't want to lose. The bed is two twins pushed together, but I think, I think it's pretty comfortable. And next to the bed, you have the telephones. You can reach um, guest services, housekeeping, dining, or ask for a wake up call. And then these are the lights right next to the bed. So this is the reading light right here, which is really cool because you can kind of swivel it to different directions, whether you are on the couch or on the bed, which is gonna be awesome for me and Eric because I like to read. When we walked into the room too, we also had our cups. We did order the deluxe beverage package, which is like the unlimited beverage package. So these are each of our cups. Over here, there's a coffee maker and a hot water maker, but they're not near any plugs. So like there aren't any plugs over here. So that I guess is something that you should consider, you should think about. And chair, just a nice chair right here. There's a couch on the side of the room. So I guess if you didn't want to sit on the bed, you could sit here or if you have multiple people in the room, it's a great place to see the TV. And then my favorite part of this room is the private balcony. So. These, so there's these curtains right here, and then you just walk out, and you have your own private balcony, which is awesome. So there's just like these two chairs right here, as well as a little table. And right now we have a beautiful view of downtown Miami. junior suite on Royal Caribbean's Navigator of the Seas Cruise. We're going on a five-night cruise through the Bahamas. If you like this video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that you never miss any of my travel tips and adventures. Thank you everyone so, so, so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye!